C'est là. C'est là. Therefore, the word yoke is not a sign of oppression, but a reminder of the covenant relationship in Christian marriage. This, look, when God put this together, he did not plan for us not to be in covenant with him. Come on. Say la again. So the world does marriage. If I don't like it, I'll leave. If it's not working what I want and ain't working, I don't have to stay. When we come together and covenant with God, your man is in covenant with God, you're in covenant with God, yeah. you come together with God. That's it. That's it. Right. Don't leave it. Be very sure your anchor holds. Your spouse, you have to cover your spouse. Yeah, that's right. 
You have to tell your, you, like I tell my husband all the time, my husband's really good because he really makes me feel like I'm the woman, I'm the bad man with <laughs> So, so he, he always, he always like, he, he's very playful. And I used to get mad like, dude, really, you quit playing don't you want me, you don't want me looking at nobody else, right? No. No, I really don't. He said, well, then that's my job, is to play with you. Take this camera. <laughs> I'll see you later. <laughs> Ooh, Lord. I'm gonna take this camera. I'll see this later. That's why they marry. That's true. Shando Hey. Oh boy. That's right, preacher. That's right. And you're speaking and so right. We have made it, the church, religion has made it. Come on. Come on. Well, when the best thing you have with your mate is that intimate time. But, but see, for us women, we have, to, we have to train them. Intimacy don't come because you want to at 10 o'clock. Intimacy comes when you empty that trash. <laughs> Telling the truth, though, what they she showed up telling the truth. She's telling the truth. She's telling the truth. When my husband decided he wanted to get on the right train, he get up in the morning and he kisses me. He says, "Babe, I love you and I'll miss you all day." Oh, that's intimacy started. Okay. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And, right, right, you know, 
Praise and God. So, so the problem with us in, in, in our relationship is that we, we're trying, the man is trying to make us like him, and the woman is trying oh, to make yeah. us like her. Yeah. Well, that's yeah. not the not gonna help. Not yeah. 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 So we have to find that common ground yeah. and learn how to maneuver and, 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 and cycle it to where, oh, this is how she... You, we gotta study our man. We gotta study okay. right. 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 You have, you have to learn. Yes. And, then, and, and see, and sometimes when we have too many partners, then you start using stuff oh. that work on that one that don't work on that one. So, okay. so oh glory. Oh glory. If you had other ones, you have got. If you're in a new relationship, you got to leave them back. Yeah. That's right. right. Say love. Take them with you. Yes. Right. 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 Because whether we want to believe it or not, every time we're intimate with another, there is a spiritual transference. Yes. Yes. Girl, come on. And when you and guess what? I learned this at college. You know what I'm saying? There's a. I learned spiritual stuff in school. Really. So, uh, but we should have been teaching this ourselves. Yeah. So there's a spiritual right. transference. So every time you with somebody, you take on part of their stuff. Come on, man. You got five people. You got five different spirits dealing with. Talk, girl. Exorcism. I need healing. I need deliverance. Yes. Yes. From yes. Joe, Jim, Jack, and whoever else. Yes. Right. So you got to get rid of that. Yes. Because it will hinder what he's trying to create and build here. We got to let go of those hurts. Who said forgiveness? Somebody talked about forgiveness today. If you cannot love somebody being mad at somebody else. That's right. 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 That's good. Right. That's good. And then our relationships are to mirror. Christ's relationship with the church. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Yeah. It, it, it should mirror what it should mirror Christ and the church. Listen, if you are dating somebody and he is not willing to sacrifice for you, then keep it moving. That's right. Oh, he just 